How are you guys today? It's Sunday night, actually. That's when I'm, um, after dinner, that's when I'm recording my book. And I have a hat on because my hair looks really bad because I was outside all day, which I hope you were too. Um, today, I should say, when you watch this on Monday, it's May 4th and May the 4th be with you. If you're a Star Wars fan, I think it's kind of funny. Should have went downstairs and got my, dug up my Star Wars t-shirt, but I didn't. I was too lazy. Maybe I'll wear it tomorrow for my recording on Tuesday. Um, so today you also have another video from me. Um, Audrey B is Star of the Week. We missed a couple Star of the Weeks. So there's a video of her sharing all her pictures. And um, I hope you guys watch it because it's really good. She did a really nice job. I went to her house. It was really fun. I also saw Gianna today. She came over to my house for a bit and dropped something off. Yeah. Woo! Great day. For those of you I saw on Friday on the parade, how fabulous was that day? Right? I mean, that was so much fun. I think my arm hurts. So I was waving, waving. My, and you couldn't see it because I had my mask on, but my cheeks hurt because I was smiling so much. So I was so glad to see it like you guys. And I got really lucky because I miss... When the kids go to Riverside, I miss seeing those kids. I had to see some of my friends that I haven't seen for a long time because they went to Riverside and they're in third grade, fourth grade, even fifth grade. And then I even saw somebody's brother who goes to Riverside, but I had the brother. He's 15. He was sitting in the front seat. I'm like, no, no, who are you? So it was just a great day to see everybody on that day. Um, yeah. And then we had this awesome weather Saturday and Sunday. So... Hang in there, guys. Things are looking better. So I decided to share this book today. And the favorite illustrator, Dave Cattrall, right? He did some of the other, um, I want my own, I want a iguana, I want my own room. Um, he is, uh, I can always tell when he's the illustrator because he kind of makes all of his animals and people the same. This one's called, That's Good, That's Bad. It's by Marjorie Coiler. Coiler? Coiler? I don't know. Pictures by David Cattrall. Okay. One day, a little boy went to the zoo with his mother and his father. They bought him a red, sh a shiny red balloon. It lifted him high up into the sky. Wow. Oh, that's good. No. That's bad. The balloon drifted for miles and miles until it came to a hot, steamy jungle. It broke on a branch of a tall, prickly tree. Pop! Oh, no. That's bad. No, it's good. That's good. How is it good? The boy fell into a muddy river. Splat! He climbed up onto a rolly Holy hippopotamus and rode to shore. Giddy up! Oh, he's safe, so that's good. No, that's bad. Uh oh, what bad happened? Ten noisy baboons were squabbling in the grass by the river. They chased the little boy up a tree until he was out of breath. Pan, pan, pan. Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. Why is it good? The baboons wanted to play vine swing with the little boy. What fun! The little boy grabbed a vine and swung out of their reach. Whee! That, no. Oh, that's good. No, that's bad. When I show you this picture, you probably can predict why it's bad. Look at that vine. Do you see the vine? What is it? Is it a vine? The vine was a big, scary snake that wiggled and jiggled and hissed. Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. The little boy lost his grip, whoops, and landed on the back of a giraffe. Hooray! Oh, that's good. No, that's bad. The giraffe leaned over to drink some swampy water. Glug, glug, glug. 
The little boy slid down his neck and fell in some quicksand next to an elephant. Slop. Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. It's pretty good about being in quicksand by an elephant. The elephant grabbed the little boy with his trunk. There we go. And lifted him up, up, up onto his sh its shoulders. Whoosh. Oh, that's good. No, that's bad. That's bad. Uh-oh. I'm going to show you the picture. You see? The elephant thumped bumpily along to a grassy plain where it stopped to feed. The little boy climbed down its trunk and woke up a daddy lion snoring in the grass. Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. When the lion saw the little boy, it purred and licked the little boy's face. Slurp. Ah, oh, that's good. Did you know I was going to say that? No, that's bad. The little boy got... The little boy got all wet and sticky. Yuck. And ran deeper into the jungle. It was as dark as night. Ooh. The little boy was afraid. He sat down and he started to cry. Boo hoo. Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. His tears made such a big puddle that a stork came along to have a drink. Sip. It picked up the little boy with its beak. Whish. Oh, that's good. That's bad. The stork flew the little boy across the dark, windy sky. Flap, flap. The little boy thought he would never see his parents again. Sob. That's bad. No, that's good. The stork knew where it was going. It took the little boy back to the zoo and dropped him into his parents' arms. Plop! His mother and father were so happy to see him. They gave him a big hug and a big kiss. Smack! Oh, that's good. No, that's great. There you go. Have a good day today. Enjoy Audrey B's Star of the Week video. Don't forget on Tuesday, May 5th at 1030, we'll have our Zoom session. I'll put it in the email. But I just want to let you know we're going to do Audrey B's um, estimation jar and her mystery bag. So we will have to um, come to the meeting with a piece of paper and pencil or a dry erase board and marker, whatever you have laying around the house. Dry erase board would work better. If you don't have one though, that's fine. No, oh, that's bad. Oh, it's good. No, just kind of being like a um, A piece of paper and a pencil or a marker or a crayon or whatever is fine too, right? And I'll include that in the, um, in the email later. Blah, whatever. All right. You guys be good today. All right. Keep reading. I'm going to sign another book probably Monday afternoon to um, have yourself record. I listen to them and I send you back a message. So if you know, if you can, I hope you can find it on, um, on Raz Kids. All right. I'll see you later. Bye guys.